No full belly, yeah. Here's full belly. Rock step, don't put all your weight on it. Pivot 90 degrees in what? Again, your foot might be a little bit in front of the line, so you can trap her foot. This called, what do we call this? Capture the, the move. She's not on her foot. Who steps first? She does, and then you're right after her. So let her make her step. Don't truncate it. You don't put weight on leaders and you just turn, what happens? She steps over. It's beautiful. How are we stepping over followers? Long and around. Long and around. How do we do that? Whole body. Whole body. If I want leaders here, I can pivot on my heel. I realize this really helps, um, especially if you have short legs. Okay, and then transfer my weight to my right, and off I go. At a minimum, it's a beautiful transition from close to open, where she does a step over sort of flat out of thing, a salva. If I want a cold gaba, what do I do? Transfer weight. And what's the line of power? Where my two feet are, yeah, they're on the line. So leaders, I send them out, and then what do I do after that? The one additional step? The cheat step to taste. It could be quarter turn or so. And then I get my weight on that hip where I made that cheat step. Because that opens the door for them to come through. And then I'm kind of back into the, the place I, were, I was before. Followers, while we're in the Kolgata, which side of our embrace are we using? Left or right? Left. It's a trick question. Both. Yes! <laughs> Whatever makes it feel comfortable, use both sides of your embrace, the left and the right. We're hanging from our leader at that time. They're like a wall. Yeah? Okay, and then for the back step over, it's the same idea. I trap her back foot. I send her through. I'm going to go ahead and do a little demo. Again, it's the same concept being recycled again and again, just in different positions. I'm going to play a half alternative song in representation of the milonga I'm going to DJ next.